What's up, YouTube, and welcome to another Minecraft Boy 4477's videos. And also, this is going to count as, um, fire alarms, but fire alarming's videos has to do with fire alarms, and I'm playing Roblox here. This is the start of my Roblox series. So, we got a True Alert horn strobe out here. This is my mansion, and that's just a restaurant that I have over there. So, we got a simplex key station. The whole system is all simplex um 4001 i mean 4100u um the enunciator the firelight enunciator but i have other panels hooked up to it i tried making a schindler 338 the technic series and i'll go up and show you the panels i don't know the models of the speaker strobes but i know the models of the just strobes they're 494 91 77 strobes remote strobes so this is a mix of a 338 and a what do they call them a 338 and a um 3300a so they got the classic um 4100u then we got a 4010 panel, and then we have a MS9200 UDLS addressable fire alarm control panel by Firelight. And you know, in my fire alarm series on fire alarms by fire alarming, so I have a lot of fire, well, not a lot, but I have a few Firelight devices. So there's, well, since I have admin, I guess like I can do, um, a, um, this is only a test. So what I'm going to do is Okay, so now I'm just going to scroll back. I'm actually going to put, plus I have two different admins on here, so, and I like, um, the scripts admin, um, message better, so, I probably spelled this regard, and I accidentally put a space between, um, alarms, so, <laughs> typing errors, so, um, so now we'll get started. So we'll close up the panel. Um, and we'll start off with the fourth floor pool station. So, I customized this elevator to fit my employee, so, yep, that's working, that's working, that's working, there's nothing over there. So, let's go to the second floor. Okay. 
That one's not on. This is why we do fire alarm tests. So I have to remember, second floor, um, speaker strobe, not working, I just knocked over it here. Yep, so this is why I do these tests. I didn't never notice that one because I usually only like have it on for like a few seconds. I know the little thing's getting annoying. Okay, these are all working. And there's nothing in the basement. So, uh, uh, other elevator takes you to the basement. And then we'll test, I'll just show you the simplex um, key switch test. Stop audio. So the cool thing about these alarms is that you can scroll between the ones that are activated. So it says fourth floor smoke and fourth floor pool station. So that's activated. That's activated, but I don't know why it's not setting it off. And that was activated, so We'll do a system. Well, I'll use a different panel this time. That one pretty much looks the same exact thing as this one. But, sorry about that. Um, I'll do a reset from this panel. See, all of them are resetting. And the LEDs on all of those turned off. And so, what everyone does when the fire alarms shut off. They do this. I mean, when it's reset. So just listen to this little thing that it has. Your attention, please. The building emergency condition has been cleared. You may return to your normal activity. The building emergency condition has been cleared. You may return to your normal activity. Your attention, please. The building emergency condition has been cleared. You may return to your normal activity. The building emergency condition has been cleared. You may return to your normal activity. Okay, so... Yeah, and I'll just show you what my character looks like. So that is me. I can't afford any hair for some reason. But, got the Simplex Fire Products thing. Simplex is one of my favorite fire alarm companies. Firelight's my second... I mean... I don't really have a ranking for them, but my top three companies is Simplex, Firelight, and System Sensor. So, now we'll go over to the next building. Oh yeah, we have a Federal Signal 3T22 out there. We'll do a test of it real quick so I can show you that. And it's not activating. You know what, I probably got rid of the antenna when I was doing an update on the world, so I'll have an update on it showing you the 3 d 22 test. Let's get ready. Oh yeah, and I said I'd show you the key test switch too. Check outside the window. Not view. Okay, so let me unlock the, okay, it works, this is what the enunciators look like, I'm saying. Okay, so, simplex switch key, so I use a different type of key, see, not blanks, like for, maybe that goes into a line. It says simplex key switch. <laughs> Wrong key. Oops. Okay, 
And this system pretty much works like a normal 4100U system. So now I'll be demonstrating the next system. Spectro Alert Classics, Firelight BG10s, and another one of these Firelight 9200 UDLS systems. I don't know what happened there with the little things. So, I guess like I'll pull it. Well, you know what? Instead of using like the one nearest to me, I'll go to the one farther than, than me. And then I have this one set, well both of them set so they have a four second delay. It's on, set on system sensor sync. Now let me turn off this piezo because I hate this thing. The little beeping thing inside of it. So now I'll show you my collection of fire alarm panels that I have. Now these used to be different people's but I upgraded them a little bit so um like new I added new features so there's the MS9200 UDLS and there's it with the thing showing up okay and they're none working I took out the script so it doesn't make my game laggy so then here is a rare panel the, the Notifier NFS 9200 UDLS, which is pretty much their copy off of this. So then we got the 4010 here, I'll show you the inside of it, so of course you didn't see the other inside of it. And it doesn't have two doors like the other panel does. It, there's the enunciator. And this is my main panel up in there. Then we got um, this what's the model number oh I can't find the model number it's like it's an adjustable pull station though I mean not pull station panel okay this one requires a key I believe it's the FA panel key no it's the RFT panel key there that's the inside of it I believe new age server alarm had one of these panels before Then we got another notifier panel, the NFS 3030, and there's its enunciator down there. Ah, I close it back up. What's going on with this? So yep, yeah, it has digital voice command, it has the classic notifier, notifier thing on it. Sorry about my speech today, it's a little off. So then we got the Simplex 4001 fire alarm panel. Pretty neat panel to have for like a collection. If you're a, a fire alarm collector and you're a beginner, that's a good panel to have. Like I have in pan I have a panel myself. Now I don't think I told my fire alarm YouTube channel this, but I have a oh what's it called? Oh yeah, um, a Napco um, MFA 6000 series, but right now I'm saving my money up to get a Firelight MS4, because those panels are neat. So yeah, and then there's the 3T22 up there, and the 3T22 is actually in our town that I live in personally. Um, and it's if the for the people who don't know who are siren fans um that one's actually um um these sirens are air raid sirens like the classic world war ii where it has the two discs and then the two dampers and all that stuff well i think the original ones didn't have dampers but um this one's the uh, like the one if you ever watched the broadmoor siren um hunt in London, uh, I, I mean UK, but I don't live in UK, I live in US, so, yeah, 
so I guess like I'm gonna end it here the video here so this is the end of this video and I'll see you in the next minecraft boy 4477's videos peace out Let's see if I can get this to stop recording it doesn't always like to work